This video will show you how Ansible can help you automate your apps, cloud instances, and infrastructure. We will demo this using InMotion Hosting's UltraStack for WordPress, which provides a highly efficient and fast environment for WordPress. The first step is creating SSH keys on your computer. Then you can add them to the Ansible control node and gain access. Once connected, you must create SSH keys on the Ansible control node. You can then add this key to any servers you want the Ansible control node to connect to. This allows the Ansible control node to gain access to these servers securely. You can then easily deploy a WordPress site and all required dependencies to the target server in just a few minutes using InMotion Hosting's UltraStack for WordPress. Now that you know the steps, let's walk through an actual deployment of a WordPress site. Begin by opening PowerShell or a similar terminal app and generate an SSH key using the command. Enter a strong password for the key, then repeat when prompted. The public key will then be created. Copy and paste it into a text editor. Then log into AMP and add the public key to your cloud VPS. Keep in mind, if your server is hosted elsewhere, these steps will differ. Once logged in, click Access My Server, then click Add Key. Enter a label for the key, paste your public key in the available field, choose the server, then click Add Key. Now, go back to the main AMP page and create a snapshot. This will allow you to revert back to this initial state if necessary. Click Create Snapshot, then enter a name. Now, SSH into the server as root to verify the SSH key was set up successfully. When prompted, enter the passphrase you set up for your SSH key. Once you've logged in successfully, you know your key is working and you can exit out of the server. Now access the Ansible control node on the main AMP page and add the key there. Select it from existing keys, then click Add Key. Next, scroll down and click the Start Ansible button. It will give you the command to access it. Copy the command to the clipboard or save it in your text editor. Then run it in your PowerShell or Terminal. Once you are connected to the Ansible control node, you need to create an SSH key for it. You may be wondering why we're creating a new SSH key. The first key allows you to connect from your computer to the cloud server. However, this key that we're about to create allows you to connect this Ansible control node to that cloud server or whatever you want to control via Ansible. Enter a strong password twice when prompted. The Ansible control node will then create your SSH key. Cat the public file and save it. Add this key to any machine you want the Ansible control node to connect to. In this example, we're deploying a brand new cloud VPS with InMotion hosting, and it will add it to the server via AMP. Do this by clicking the Manage SSH Keys link on the main page. Now that the key is set up, we can return to the Ansible control node PowerShell window. Change to the WordPress UltraStack Ansible folder. Copy the inventory.sample.yml file, then edit and update it. In this example, I'm using the server's IP address instead of a URL. Update the domain. the site domain, the site email, the site user, 
and the site pass. If you want to use an SSL certificate, you should also consider setting the Use Let's Encrypt option to True. Then save your settings. If you look at the IP address of your server, there is nothing there yet. Next, let's run the WordPress UltraStack Ansible playbook to deploy a WordPress site to the server with all required dependencies. Enter the passphrase of your Ansible control node when prompted. This will take several minutes to complete. Then navigate to the server's IP. When you refresh the page, you will see a brand new installation of WordPress. You can now log in and begin building a site. Check out our InMotion Hosting Support Center for help with your website. We provide thousands of step-by-step -step guides, videos, and much more to lead you towards making your online project a successful one. You can find us at www.inmotionhosting.com support.